Good afternoon. It's August 3rd, 2019, and I finally got finished with uh, the Cunningham walk behind tractor. I'm guessing this is from the mid 1940s. The workmanship is not all that great. It probably got better towards the last five years they made these. Um, but this one is, is not put together all that great. But this is the only one I've ever seen, probably the only one in North Carolina. But I want to just kind of give you a walk around. You can see what I was talking about in the previous video. There is the actual drive with the two spring-loaded fingers on the back side. I just put this motor on just to give you an idea of what it would look like. It would actually have a motor more like a, a old Briggs and Stratton in with a tank sitting above the motor. It's a very, very simple mechanism. With just a tension pulley driving uh, a reduction gear and then the reduction gear, you know, driving the, uh, the axles. I'll have to figure out exactly what uh, size bell and there are adjustments slots for the, or holes for the uh, tension pulley. So it'll be a matter of just playing with it to, to get it to where it goes in and out of uh, gear, so to speak. It did have the the name plate on it still. I'll show you that. I don't know how clear it would be. This is a, a, a Model CA Cunningham. And again, it's my guess that this was um, from the mid-1940s because the pictures you see of them, and they only made them five years, so by the time 1950 came, they were a lot better looking uh, tractor than this one. But I hope you're having a good weekend, and uh, I have to see if I can find me something else to do. Y'all take care. Bye-bye.